This is for all those stay at home, play at home, learn at home friends of mine with kids. I was at breakfast and I was uh, looking at my cereal box and I saw a picture of an oat and I looked very closely at that oat in that picture and it seemed to sing a song to me, a song I remember from Bob Dylan. It went like, uh, you would not know to look at me, but I was famous long ago, or something like that. But uh, And I thought, look at that little oat there all flattened out. And I thought, uh, the words came to me, you would not know to look at me, but I was famous in my field. And from that, uh, I, I, I cut out the, the card and I carried it around. I thought, I'm going to show this. Anyway, it led to an idea for home where storytelling is such a great uh, help uh, in, in, in learning situations. Uh, I saw a Kickstarter video, for example, a woman living in Switzerland with two daughters, and she came up with a way to teach coding by story storytelling. It's not uh, the only idea. I saw a lot of storytelling leading to coding, but I thought, uh, how do we get started making a story? And so I thought I'd share this this little thing with me, and we'll see how far it goes. To begin in with, as I said, I saw the ser the uh, the picture on the cereal box, and I wrote the story at breakfast. And uh, I looked at it the next day, and I thought, well, it's so cute, I think I'll cut it out. And I cut it out. And then the next day after that, I looked, and um, I, it was like a window, and I thought of a stage, and I thought of puppets, and I thought of a story uh, about the oat. And uh, so this is, this is what I came to. I, I took a, another kind of oat and I made two characters and uh, I tried to think of what they would say to each other, what kind of story they would tell each other about being an oat and uh, the, the life and the end of the oat. So, thanks for watching.